Hi and welcome to this edition of Out of the Box. I'm Paul Sillers of Firewalls for Now and Firewall News. Um, and in this edition, we're going to be looking at the Meraki MS2208 P, um, which is quite a mouthful to say, um, but that is a managed switch um, that's an eight port. So, as you know, these are not meant to be technical overviews, they're just to, an idea of what's in the box. Plenty of stock images out there, and it's always good to be able to see um, what the actual product looks like. So this is, an, an, this is the entry level switch um, that Meraki provide. Um, no fancy boxing particularly. I'm just gonna open that up for you. Um, you get a contents guide on the top here. Uh, you get a look at what the switch is at the bottom there. Um, you'll pr probably get a uh, power supply uh, that is American. Hopefully it's been swapped out for you to um, be for your region, and then you get the switch. So we'll have a little look at that, uh, see what you think. It's really difficult for me to have a, uh, I don't know, I try and give you not a too biased opinion on this. So this is an eight port switch, you've got two SFPs on the end um, there. Uh, there are many vendors right now who have an eight port switch. This is almost an identical box. You can see their standard um, IEC, um, sometimes referred to as a kettle lead connection. Now, all of Meraki products, they don't run unless you have um, their cloud controller software. So that's a license that you pay for every year. Um, the more years you purchase, um, the less it, uh, the, the more savings that you make. Now, at an eight port switch, it, it's quite difficult in my mind to figure out where this sits. This sits around about um, 800, 900, uh, plus a little bit uh, Australian dollars. There are some competitors out there um, who seem to have pretty much the same case, um, most of the same functionality, other than the cloud controller software, which Meraki stuff I love, the dashboard's brilliant, the stuff you can see on this, application level and everything that you can see, even if you don't have a router that supports application, it can do it on this box here. If you are just buying an eight port cloud managed box, then there are other vendors that are down in the $200 mark. Now, if this is going to be for your rest of your solution that's all Meraki and wireless, great product. Um, but it's a lot of money for a small box. Obviously, as soon as you start moving 16 port, 18 port, 24 port switches and above, then fantastic. But at this end of the, bottom, um, end of the market, something a little bit difficult. So there's my own personal opinion. Other than this is a fantastically well-built unit. It's quite light. Um, eight ports in there, fantastic. Um, obviously, like I said, all of the cloud management features, this is a PoE switch, so it's full eight ports of uh, PoE. Um, the management interface is second to none. So you just plug this in, it immediately talks home, you log into the interface that you um, uh, rent, if you like, on an ongoing basis from Meraki, and immediately it'll tell you what machines it's seen, what IPs they're running on, what DHCP broadcasts are going on, what applications are flowing over your network, um, and you can set rules for that and manage all of the ports. So I love it from that feature side of things. It's just a little bit difficult to give you an objection, objective overview of spending $1,000 or so on an eight port switch. But in a, in a setup where you've got everything else running and you want single pane of glass, fantastic little product. So hopefully that's given you, there's not really much to show you other than that, but this is the Meraki MS2208 P, the managed eight port power over ethernet switch. Hopefully that's been useful. My name is Paul Sillers of Firewalls for Now and Firewall News.